Prince William makes a statement as soldiers collapse before a historic ceremony. Prince William issued a statement regarding the review of the colonel he oversaw today. Three members of the army passed out, during a rehearsal before the celebration of the King's birthday next week. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. If you're new here, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British royal family. Prince William paid tribute to the troops after three soldiers passed out due to difficult conditions during the final troop color rehearsal. During a rehearsal, known as the Colonel's Review, a member of the band collapsed with his trumpet in hand. As the rehearsal continues, another soldier is seen being led away on a stretcher. A member of the family division's rallying gang got back to his feet after collapsing and was met with applause from the audience. Royal fans gathered to watch the Prince of Wales step up to perform in his first major role during Trooping the Colour. Prince William did the Colonel's review today just seven days before the King's birthday show next week. He tweeted before the training, months of preparation and training go into the color squad. Today the members of the family section will hold their final major rehearsal for the event in front of members of the public in London. After the rehearsal, in which three privates fainted, he wrote, many thanks to every soldier who took part in the colonel's parade this morning in the heat. Tough circumstances but you all did a really good job. Thank you. More than 1,400 soldiers of the House Band and the King's Troop Royal Horse Artillery, including 400 musicians from the massed bands, took part in the review. Severe temperatures this weekend prompted the UK Health Security Agency to issue an amber warning for eastern and southern England. James Calford, 18, of Cardiff, who was the youngest soldier to take part in the Welsh Guards, described trooping the colour as like standing in a sauna with a 200 kg dumbbell in your left hand. He said that the ceremony is a lot more difficult than it looks on TV. Once you put on a jacket and a bare skin and carry your gun in the heat, it becomes incredibly uncomfortable. Royal commentator Richard Eden told the Daily Mail that Meghan Markle and Prince Harry were not invited to the monarch's birthday party. I've heard that Prince Harry and Meghan have not, however, been invited to the King's birthday parade next weekend. It will be the first time in Harry's life that he has not been welcomed into the official celebrations of the King's birthday. A source added, I'm afraid this is a reflection of the state of relations at the moment. Thanks for watching till the end.